Don't you hate it when you end a relationship and you do all the cleanup on social media and then you finally change that relationship status and then the next thing you know, boom, mere moments later, dating side ads. Welcome back to Grave Uncut. As you can tell, this video is on dating side ads. Now, just a couple months back, I ended up out of a relationship. I'm not gonna go into detail on it, but ever since getting rid of the photos ever since changing the relationship status i've seen nothing but countless dating site ads we're talking plenty of fish tinder you name it they're all fucking there now these ads started popping up the second the relationship status changed literally going from in a relationship to single nothing but plenty of fish tinder bumble whatever they're there but my whole argument on this is i get that these dating sites are basically business run but people don't just necessarily jump in from one relation to the other even though i'm pretty sure there are those people that just say fuck it and just jump into the next relationship but there are those of us that just don't do that like they want to take the time to heal they want to take the time to like step back reevaluate shit and get this sh get their shit together these dating site ads just boom plenty of fish boom tinder boom bumble whatever fucking other dating sites that are out there match fucking whatever and nobody has the time to fucking heal they don't have the time to fucking clear their shit out they just just bombard you with fucking dating side ads. Now I get it. The business. But the thing is, the last thing I want to think about after a relationship ends, whether it be six months, a year, two years, whatever, the last thing I want to think about is dating again, just to get my shit straight. But now I know what some of you are going to say. Oh, you can just ignore it. No, because really on my news feed, like every other freaking Facebook post that I see between friends and other advertisements, it's literally just dating site after dating site after dating site, just saying, oh, try Plenty of Fish, try Bumble, try Tinder, try Match. That's not how I work as far as that. I want to take my time to myself, reevaluate shit, and get my head straight. Plus, on top of everything else, dating sites kind of suck. Especially Plenty of Fish. I got a real hate relationship with Plenty of Fish. Not gonna go into that. Fuck Plenty of Fish. You see these dating sites everywhere. Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, you name it. They're there. And, and I get it. Sites want to get their names out. They want to be like, oh, they want to just jump on to get like more users and stuff on their sites. That's not how a lot of people work. <laughs> they gotta fucking heal. They gotta fucking get over their bullshit. Anyway, at least give us a month before these ads start popping up all over Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Literally, the second that relationship status changes from in a relationship to single, all you see is plenty of fish, bumble, t uh, tender. All over the fucking place. All you need to do is just give us a, at least a month to fucking clear shit up. I mean, this shit doesn't skip a beat. Literally, the second the, st the status changes, all you see is just these dating site ads. They're all over. The dating app ads, all over the fucking place. My whole thing is, I want to get my head straight before I even consider going back into the dating world. I mean, the main reason why I haven't put out any content over the last uh, couple of weeks, I think the last video I put up was just me and the guys reviewing Halloween. And that was fun to do as far as keeping my head straight. And I just want to say uh, thank you to everybody that's close to me, Reyes, Brutal Gunplay, my family, my other friends for helping me get through this shit and uh, I also want to thank YouTube as far as like to have an outlet to actually communicate all this shit to you I mean I'm not gonna go into details as far as what happened with my last thing that's just gonna stay where it is anybody that's going through any breakup related shit um, your best bet to deal with that is reach out to your friends reach out to your family I don't want to sound preachy, but that's basically how it is. Like, reach out, get a hobby, uh, just do whatever you can to occupy your mind. Like, keep your head off of the past and just move on from it. Just remember that a the end of a relationship is not the end of the world. It's just a little bump in the road. Just got to get over it and move on. But again, as I said, if you're going through shit, reach out. Uh, talk to your friends, talk to your family, talk to the ones that are closest to you to get through it. They'll be the ones to help you and... You can be there for them when they're in the same situation that you're in. I know this video kind of had a bit of a serious tone to it. I just want to thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys actually had a little bit of a laugh as far as me uh, bitching about the dating side ads popping up literally the second a relationship ends. It's really fucking stupid to have those things fucking pop up. Like, the second... Like, I'm not even joking. The second I change that status, two freaking posts down as I'm scrolling through Facebook, pff, plenty of fish. And if I find the circle, how plenty of fish was the very first one that pops up. I fucking despise that fucking app. <laughs> I want to thank you guys for watching. Uh, keep an eye out for more content. Check out uh, Grave Uncut Gaming. You'll see me and the guys on there playing Call of Duty and a bunch of other games also. And don't forget to check out my friends' channels, Reyes, Brutals. Uh, there's like a few others in the description below. If you're just freshly single and like trying to move on from everything... Keep your head up and uh, live on. I want to thank you guys again for watching. Like, subscribe, favorite. 
and I will see you guys in the next video. Also, don't forget to hit that little bell icon thing just to stay notified whenever I upload content. And, as I said, rest easy.